But I say unto you that ye resist not evil. That's what the Lord Jesus tell us in the book of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 39. Now listen, I'm a mechanical engineer with a bachelor's of science in mechanical engineering and a specialization in aerospace. And I want to try and use some physics uh, to, you know, go over the scripture with you. Resistance is what gives the evil life, right? And so we're going to look at pressure. Pressure is defined as force over area, right? A certain force, like a pound, uh, a kilogram or something like that in a certain area, a square. Uh, and the area is defined in, in, in a square inch, a square foot, something like that. It's a cross-sectional area. And the pressure is, 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 is labeled in PSI or megapascals or something like that. And what you need to understand is, for, for one, the equation force over area. If you don't got no area for the force to resist, you don't got no pressure, right? So that's what the Lord is telling us, you know, resist, not evil, you know? And so, and that's regarding pressure, right? So pressure, you need a restriction of the fluid flow, fluid flow, whether it be a, a, a air uh, or a a, 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 a fluid, a, a, a compressible or a non-compressible thing. You see what I'm saying? Uh, fluid is non-compressible. Air is compressible. Okay? Uh, and so, you can think about your, your, your vehicle. Like, your, and I know this is hard for people to understand. They might not know nothing about cars, but, you know, your, 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 uh, your vehicle, it has a gas that goes up in there. Right. Yeah, uh, it's, it's a gas water mixture when it atomizes the fuel to go into the cylinder and, and, and it ignites and explodes. Right. And without a seal and a piston. So the pistons have to be in the, the engine block and properly sealed. If they're not properly sealed, the pressure or the resistance is not going to be there. And the gases is going to flow past the uh the whatchamacallums, and, you, you know, past the piston seals, and your engine is not going to work properly. You're not going to have all the power, and it might just break down completely. And so without that resistance, your engine is not going to work. So you see, with reading, pressure, your engine working, uh, resistance is what makes this thing work. And on the contrary, if I think about this, with electricity, an unseen thing, and I think about the spirit when I think about the unseen, that the least amount of resistance that you have, right? You want you want to find things that that like the copper. That's why we use copper in our 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 uh, our cables because it has low resistance. It doesn't have the lowest resistance, but it has low resistance. And the lower the resistance, the easier it is for your electrical components. To, to operate properly so that, you know, um, the more resistance, what happens is you get heat, right? And that's how you have these uh, conductive heaters and things like that. And that basically, it's just resistant. And so when you resist the spirit, you're going to find heat. You see what I'm saying? So when you resist the flesh, you find pain. Um, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. When you don't resist the flesh being the evil being done onto you, things go well, right? And then when you resist the spirit, things go bad. You see? So don't resist evil as the Lord Jesus told you. You see? Don't 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 put no resistance up. And also don't resist the spirit. So yeah, that's 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 dope. I like that. I like that. So that that just came to me this morning, and uh, I figured I'd share it with you. You know, the Lord had I spent years going to get that degree for some reason, you know. So I need to use it for the Lord. Have a blessed day.